Everything else is ready, and it's time for the passengers to get on the plane. The passengers are all aboard. The moment that had us riveted and millions all over the world watching, Felix Baumgartner attempting the highest skydive ever, free-falling at speeds that surpassed 700 miles an hour. He was trying to smash the sound barrier. There were moments of danger when it seemed like he might spin out of control in that free fall. He plummeted at an inconceivable 833 miles per hour. The first human to break the sound barrier with just his body. No jet, no rocket. Release seatbelt. Oh God, oh God. of the U.S. from Virginia to New England all the way to the Great Lakes. It's already caused both candidates to scramble their schedules. It will complicate both campaigns ever seen in their voters. Prophecy meets modern anxiety. Oh, 
bright morning in St. Peter's Square, Pope Benedict XVI bowed out after almost eight years as leader of the Catholic Church. He's the first Pope to retire in 600 years. After stepping down, he'll move to a monastery within the Vatican walls. We're going to skate to one song, one song only. The American computer technician who says he leaked top secret facts on our government's phone and internet surveillance is apparently on the run. He's 29-year-old Edward Snowden. Much of what we know about his background comes from his own interviews with two newspapers. He felt compelled to reveal the surveillance state that he discovered at the NSA, knowing that this could upset his, quote, very comfortable life. Today, uh, there were uh, simultaneous explosions that occurred along the route of the Boston Marathon near the finish line. Uh, these explosions occurred 50 to 100 yards apart, and uh, each scene uh, resulted in multiple uh, death rates. Like the legend of the Phoenix. Ends with beginnings What keeps the planet sinning Ah, uh, the force from the beginning
fellow South Africans, our beloved founding president, Nelson Holishasla Mandela, has passed on in the company of his family on the 5th of December. He is now at peace. Flying above number 10 Downing Street, the British Prime Minister's residence has been lowered to half-mast. People have been visiting Mrs Thatcher's London residence to pay their respects. Supporters laid flowers and left notes addressed to the Iron Lady. and it's 90% fatal. So far, it's estimated the Ebola virus has claimed around 185 lives in Guinea and Liberia. Now it appears to have spread to Sierra Leone, according to WHO. My girl got a minimum, keep you stuck right there till the number come. Leave it smooth, I've already looking like a bum. My girl's got a city to run, got the key to the kingdom where the money's from. Never seen the color yellow, never seen the sun. And he thinks I'm the negative one. Flags flapping in Manhattan, New York, New York, gargoyles goggling oil, peak of the empire, top of the rock. Flags flapping in Manhattan, New York, New York, gargoyles goggling oil, peak of the empire, top of the rock. My girl's got a little stick, keep you cooled up in the kitchen while you feed the cake, keep you waiting in the window while the tanks ticks. My girl got a limousine, got a full time job just to keep it clean, got a speaker in the trunk, you know where it's done. I think I'm the negative one. Breaking news tonight, a Malaysia Airlines flight with 239 people on board, including four Americans, has gone missing. At this hour, a desperate search is underway for MH Flight 370. Challenge raising more than a hundred million dollars. Scientists say that money funded new research that could lead to new therapies. Girl comes up to me and says, What you drive? And I said, Bugatti. Girl comes up to me and says, What you drive? And I said, Bugatti. Girl comes up to me and says, What you drive? And I said, Bugatti.
Thousands of people and around 40 world leaders have gathered in Paris for a unity march. More than a million marches are expected to take part, carrying flags, Je suis Charlie banners and tributes to victims. Survivors is still the number one priority. on November 13th, which also targeted cafes, restaurants and a sports stadium.
announced that David Bowie has died peacefully. Prince, the innovative, one-of-a-kind artist who has given us so much great music over the decades, has been found dead. Muhammad Ali was 74 years old and had been suffering from Parkinson's disease. Breaking news via Thames Valley Police, who have confirmed the death of the singer George Michael at the age of 53. Fidel Castro, de facto dictator of Cuba, dead tonight at the age of 90. people have voted to leave the European Union and their will must be respected. But I do not think it would be right for me to try to be the captain that steers our country to its next destination. Michael Phelps won his record 23rd gold medal last night, the most ever for any athlete in any sport. Usain Bolt, the greatest sprinter of all time, helping himself to a place in the history books. Enough of the arguments 
she sips a Coca-Cola She can't tell the difference yet She can't tell the difference yet She can't tell the difference yet Out of the fallout from the Fire Festival, it was supposed to be a glamorous, luxurious Caribbean concert getaway, but it turned out to be anything but. Now the event's co-founder has been arrested and is facing up to 20 years in prison. Prison. This 
that's America. Don't catch you slipping now. Don't catch you slipping now. Look what I'm whipping now. This is America. Guns in my area. I got the strap. I gotta carry him. Yeah, yeah, I'ma go into this. Yeah, yeah, this is Gorilla. Yeah, yeah, I'ma go get your bag. Yeah, yeah, or I'ma get your pad. Yeah, yeah, I'm so cold, like, yeah. Yeah, I'm so dull, like, yeah. Woo, we gon' blow, like, yeah. has begun. The head of the rescue mission said it could take up to four days to rescue the 12 boys and their football coach from the flooded cave where they've been trapped for the last fortnight. Saudi Arabia giving women the right to drive. This is a historic day for Saudi society, for men and women. And we can now say at last. Queen of Soul, the woman whose powerful voice was singular and whose lyrics were the backdrop of so much history in this country. Aretha Franklin has died. The body is the game, fuck the legs, fuck the thing. I'm the controller. The body is the game, fuck the legs, fuck the thing. I'm the controller. to get motor neural disease. I have been very fortunate in almost everything else. jacketed for 
protesters. They were there last weekend, they've been there actually most of the weekend for last month. And this seems like, yes, I get it. Get it. Venezuela, a country in crisis, its borders, the latest battleground. These people, waiting for food and medicine at the Colombian frontier, were met with violence, tear gas, and intimidation from armed supporters of President Nicolas Maduro. Maduro has been accused of undermining democracy and causing Venezuela's economic crisis. in Hong Kong reaching a new level of violence as police now say they arrested over 260 people in just one day most are students demonstrators are angry their demands for more freedom from China and police accountability aren't being met Doping agency banned Russia from all major sports events for the next four years, a period that would include the next Summer and Winter Olympics and also the 2022 Football World Cup. Water pouring down from the ceiling, I knew this would happen, still hard to believe it. Maybe I'm dramatic, I don't want to see me, I don't want to panic. It's a mad world All of my friends Know it's heaven You're a bad thing of an unknown pneumonia-like virus, which officials say comes from the same family as the deadly SARS virus. Health authorities say that only 40 other people are infected. I'm the bad guy. You put your hands in God's
country is burning. It's been labelled the worst fire season ever recorded. From the New South Wales Victoria border all the way to the central coast, nine blazes reached emergency warning level today. I can't live without your love. My mind is always in a rush. Sometimes I love you way too much. From this evening, I must give the British people a very simple instruction. You must stay at home. has officially called it COVID-19, COVID corona, vi for virus, D for disease, and 19 because it started last year. the United States. 
Keep in mind the Trump campaign is in the midst of waging legal challenges in several states, but the path is clear for the new president-elect. Starting next month, Austrian police will carry out random spot checks to see whether people can produce proof of vaccination. It's a human sign.
causing a giant traffic jam for ships that move much of the world's goods. days of protests against COVID-19 vaccination mandate for truckers who cross the U.S.-Canadian border. Speaking on national television, Mr. Putin urged Ukrainian troops to lay down their arms and go home.
This morning, the shooting death of Japan's former Prime Minister Shinzo Abe, sending shockwaves across the country. Around 11.30 a.m. local time, the 67-year-old ex-leader was giving a campaign speech in the western city of Nara when a man reportedly shot him from behind with what appeared to be a homemade firearm described as a shotgun. You made my lonely life a paradise. You made my lonely life a paradise. You made my lonely life a paradise. You made my lonely life a BBC is interrupting its normal programs to bring you an important announcement. Buckingham Palace has announced the death of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. In a statement, the palace said the Queen died peacefully at Balmoral this afternoon. It's Oh